<gasps> hey guys, so today I'm actually filming another hair tutorial today, which is kind of crazy because I like never do hair tutorial tutorials. So, so yeah, maybe you can tell that my room is different. Um, I changed around my setting types. Yeah. So um, yeah. So yeah, this tutorial is really easy and I got this inspired by Luxie Hair on YouTube so this is not really my idea but I just changed it a little bit. So this is just basically a ponytail that makes your hair look so long and I love this. I've been doing it so much because I don't really like my hair in a ponytail when it's not like this. Alright, so starting off, um, I'm just going to not. You can do like a bump at the top or whatever but I don't, I don't like to do that. So, so the only thing tricky about this hairstyle is how you section it. So what you want to do is take at the nape of your neck and take your two fingers and you want to trace the perimeter of your head. So like this and then once you get about to your like eyebrows you just want to go straight. So kind of makes an upside down U. And unlike Luxie Hair's video this will make sure that um, you don't have like a part. Um, so you can't tell that it's two separate ponies. So you can see that. So hopefully you can see that I brought it from the sides. So again, just bring from the nape of your neck and just kind of trace like the perimeter. So you want about the same amount of hair from the top and the bottom, but if anything, make your top hair, your top ponytail have less hair because um, it, if the bottom has less hair, then it looks a little bit funky. So just about the same amount of hair, um, but you just, you just want to make sure that on the side it comes this is confusing, but you want to make sure that your top ponytail has all the hair from the side of your head pulled up too. So again, it's like an upside down you. So, we're just going to section off the bottom hair for right now, just so it's not in our way. Just do like a little pump. <laughs> I just like smack myself in the face. Alright, so there's that and you want to flip your head over. Ow. And bring this into a pony. So you can do like a French braid or a Dutch braid or whatever kind of braid or anything, like a poof if you want on the top, but I'm just going to do a regular pony. So I'm going to put it right about, like right at the top of my head and just secure that with any kind of hair tie that you want. So there's that and then, so you, this is when you decide how high you want your, how long you want your pony to be. So. I have pretty long hair and this is how long it would be if I didn't do this trick. Okay, so now what you want to do is take the bottom section and you want to take a little elastic and make that into a ponytail. Now this will be the length of your how long you want your hair to be. So I'm just going to, so I'm going to put it about right above the nape of my neck and tie it. So just tie it and there's that. So that is basically how long your ponytail is now. Okay, so now what you want to do so it doesn't look like you have like two ponytails, um, you just kind of want to pin them together and this is kind of tricky but you'll get the hang of it. You just want to take a bobby pin and if you see how it's separated, what you want to do is just kind of take the bottom layer of the top ponytail and pin it so you can see it's already like in, like stuck to your head and I just do like two. So just like that, so that if you go like that, it doesn't look like you have two ponytails. Um, it does look a little bit different than a normal ponytail, but I mean, obviously it's good. So, eh. Alright. So then you just want to pin wherever you want to, um, to make, to make it look more real than it is. So what I like to do is just kind of take the bottom ponytail and take pieces, the end pieces, and take them and pin and I just pin them like farther out so that it looks like all the hair is just kind of like together instead of two separate um, ends. Okay. Okay, so you can see how long my ponytail is now and this is a complete like craze like invention. Like whoever invented this is awesome. But unlike Luxie, 
Unlike Luxier's video, we don't have the part so that it looks like a full ponytail because we set because of how we sectioned it. Um, that's how. And just kind of pin where it needs pinning. Yeah. Good gravy! It's hot in my room. Now I just like to pull down some pieces, and you can add like little hair accessories and stuff, and curl your hair or straighten it. Um, I'm gonna. I'm just going to add a little bow, and this is from Forever 21, and, yeah, so, so, hold on, <laughs> there, some difficulties with the bow going on here. Alright, so that is your little pony. So, um, that is basically the video. I hope that you guys followed along. Um, but basically, it just makes your ponytail super long and pretty real looking. Like, so I've been loving doing this lately, and I've get, gotten so many compliments on my hair and asking if they're extensions. And I like let them feel it, and they're like, oh my gosh, no way. I'm like, yeah, way. But it's really just a big secret. So um, I hope that you guys enjoy it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And I will um, see you later. Hope that you guys enjoy. Hope you guys like this new setup. And I will teach you what my baby have gel.